In this video, you'll learn how to sign up for the CrateDB Cloud, create a new database cluster, and retrieve your connection credentials. So let's just dive on in and get started. We're going to begin here at the CrateDB website. So take your browser to CrateDB.com, and then you're going to click on this Get Started button in the top right. And we want to go with the CrateDB Cloud option today. As you'll see, we can start for free. So click Start for free. And you'll be taken here to the CrateDB Cloud Console login. You won't have an account at this point, so you'll need to sign up. You can choose to sign up with one of the social services, so GitHub, Google, or Microsoft. Or you can just pick a username and a password. Whichever one you choose, you're going to be sent an email with a verification code, and that's got a link in it. Once you receive that email, click the link, and you'll come back to the Cloud Console. As you can see here, I'm now signed in, and the first thing we need to do when we're a new user is create an organization. Think of this as like a company or something that you want to keep all of your database clusters organized under. So go ahead here and enter your company name or uh, your own name or whatever you want to call your organization. I'm going to call mine CrateDB as that's where I work. And I'm going to click Create Organization. So as you can see, that's happened. We've now created an organization. It's like a holding container for clusters and there are no clusters in it at the moment. So the next thing we want to do is go ahead and deploy a cluster. So we'll click the button there. And here we get some choices. So for production, we might want to very 